what's up? We got a new episode of How Made going on here. I just finished filming the other robot flower How Made, and I thought, you know, since I'm already filming this, might as well do all the other ones I was thinking of. So we got one little scene of BFDI that I was really happy with that I thought turned out better than I thought it would. So here's me sort of showing off a thing I'm so happy with, and that's this little animation here with Donut and... Oh, loud. That's, that's loud! Too loud! Too loud! You can see I'm, I'm really over-eager to talk in the Luigi voice because I'm so sad that he's gone. He was my favorite character, and he's just gone just like that. Just because the voters voted him off in a show where people vote characters they don't like off? It's not fair! It's not fair! And I'm not happy about it. But this, I remember seeing Carrie's reaction video to it and it was like, Is this a simulation? Was this simulated? Gotcha, it's not a simulation, it's made from scratch. How was it done? Well, here we go. We got this. Look at that. All beautifully handcrafted. Can you believe it? And, and look at this. This is just a mask. Inside it, we've got this really cool... Like, I really hope I can use this in the future because I really like how it looks. We've got three different gradients all added up. Like, this is just the basic rainbow gradient that you can use in a flash. Like, if you go to your palette... Sorry if you've got a small screen. You know, I got everything really tiny here because I got a big monitor. But, you know, just this built-in little gradient here you know you, you have that and if you just put three of them on top of each other they look really cool and they're all animated i think i made it so that they're all just offset by a third so it's like perfectly symmetrical and it just looks like magic and it's got kind of like an underexposed effect too because i think i overdid no i wanted to like make it look dark still so it's kind of yeah got a really cool deep look to it I'm really happy about that. But the most important thing about this effect is the mask. Can I find it? It's one of these layers, I know that. All right, we got this. That's a graphic. Oh no, we gotta drill down into this thing. We got graphics inside graphics. I have to blame myself for that, but I think every single graphic here, every single nesting here, we're already here, like one, two, three, four. We're four graphics deep. That's what you need to make something that's really cool because you can just add stuff on top of each other and it gets deeper each time. It's really magical. You can just, I mean, it's like working with something that you can work with really well. And if we just step through this, you can see that, yeah, these are all just hand drawn. And I think the main thing that makes this look as smooth as it does is just. I guess having to keep track of every single drop, that's like the hardest part, is like making sure that no drop gets forgotten, making sure that every single surface kind of has a follow through. It's like, oh, was this going this way in this frame? Oh, well, I gotta keep making it go that way in the next frame. And that's, I think the hardest thing is like, just keeping them all in your brain, trying to remember which ones go where. That's the hardest part. And Trying to, and that's what gives it the sense of uh, weight. That's a really important part in making this look convincing is that you don't have drops like evaporating, just disappearing suddenly. You don't have like a blob of water suddenly like just shrink into a dot. And yeah, that's just, I don't know. I really hope I can improve with that because it's like with this tiny little thing, all it's all in 2D. It's just already, it was kind of hard to do so. Once again, the reason I'm sort of, I'm sort of just talking about how good it is is because I really did not expect it to turn out like it did. And that's, I guess, why I'm so happy about it because this is more flattering than it should be. You know, this is, this is a stroke of luck. This is not something that happened through practice. I have not been practicing this enough as m much as I want to. Man, I could look at this for ages. No, I don't know. But yeah, being able to just do that was really fun. What else can I talk about, really? I mean, I have a recording of myself drawing it, so I think this will be the time where this goes in.
thank you for watching this episode of Homemade.